Now it's no secret that women like to watch their waistline and we love to hunt out alternatives that are going to be low fat but not compromise on flavour. Now as breakfast is the most important meal of the day, we are told that all the time, it's really important that we enjoy what we eat but it's also really good for us. I have created two gorgeous and really healthy breakfasts that I'm going to show you today and I've got Amanda Ursel here with me to help to help us really find out what, what we're doing nutritionally right here. Now, yeah. I love Almond Breeze milk because it tastes delicious, yeah. but what good does it do? If you go for the unsweetened Almond Breeze, it's got only 29 calories per 100 ml, so that's less than skimmed milk. And then the original one, is only 48 calories, about on a par with a semi skin milk. But they're also packed with calcium, because one of the things that's a problem when you switch from dairy milk to other alternatives is that sometimes the calcium levels aren't very high. Yes. These are absolutely on a par with ordinary milk. So Amanda, for my pancakes, I'm going to use apples, a little baking powder, because I want that thick American style kind of pancake, vanilla extract, plain flour, eggs, and of course my almond breeze milk. Amanda, I'm going to put in plain flour here, yep. but I'm sure there are other flours that you could use, right? Maybe you could just use half and half white flour with wholemeal flour just to up the fibre a little bit. OK. So I'm going to make a little well there. I've put my flour and baking powder. I'm going to now measure out my almond breeze milk. Mm -hmm. eggs. Upping the protein of the, of the breakfast, which okay, is brilliant. OK. Brilliant. Give that a whisk. If you don't mind starting, grating it up. You see, usually yep. my nine-year-old would do that for me. Right, I'm going to stand You'll in You'll have then. to be my nine-year-old today. And you're leaving the skin on. Apples are great for soluble fibre, which okay. is good for helping to lower cholesterol. Well, why I put it in as well is it makes it more filling, but yeah. also I then don't have to add sugar. Good so idea. I'm going to add some vanilla extract. Extract, not essence. It's far better flavour. So I've made my well. Just keep whisking until nicely combined. Which are your favourite apples for this recipe? Obviously not cooking apples because we want that sweetness, but any apple that tickles your fancy okay. is going to work in these pancakes, okay? Mm -hmm. Just stir in the apples, look at that, gorgeous. That does look lovely. My husband's a marathon runner Ooh. and this is what he has before he runs his marathons. Okay, I'm just going to put a little bit of butter there. See how nice and hot that pan is, you want it like that otherwise you get a soggy pancake. I'm just going to spoon in some of the mixture into the middle. And when you think about normal breakfast, and we were just chatting earlier, weren't we? You were saying you, know, you have toast with butter and things. Actually, this is probably quite a lot healthier in a way because it's just it's a tiny bit of butter, it's loads of pancake, and you've got the fruit in there. So. And it's worth getting eggs yes, into kids. Because I don't yes, know about you, but if I put an egg on a plate for my mm. child, she'll throw it back at me. Yeah. Okay, and that will bubble away. How's it looking? Yeah, it's looking quite nice and gold, so I'm going to flip it over. I'm not going to throw it in the air, don't worry. Sprinkle mm. a little icing sugar on the top. Yeah. And there you have it, apple pancakes. Absolutely lovely. So, Amanda, now I'm going to show you how to make my gorgeous herby scrambled eggs. And for them, I need eggs, a mixture of herbs. Today I'm going to use dill, parsley, maybe a little basil, but you could use whatever herbs you okay. like the most. My almond breeze milk, a little salt and pepper. I'm going to use a little butter as well for flavour. So I'm going to start with my eggs. Eight in. Which are brilliant breakfast food. Literally, there's just some research out showing that they really do help to keep you feeling full during the morning. Add a little pepper. Okay, now I'm going to add my almond breeze milk. Having a good quality breakfast can help you concentrate in the morning ahead. It helps uh, children at school do better. They can do, they've actually done tests to show that their um, arithmetic skills are better, uh -huh. their verbal reasoning skills are better. Wow. So I've got the eggs and the almond breeze mm -hmm. whisked up now. I'm going to add some herbs, a little dill, okay. some parsley, and I just think it goes so well with eggs. Mm. I'm going to add a little torn basil. I'm going to add some butter, melt that down. Mm -hmm. Some people like them as soft as this. Mm -hmm. My husband I does. do actually, I love do it. Do like you? That. Yeah, yeah. You're a soft I love it. Like girl. Yeah. I like I it a little it. firmer. So I've got some toasted bagels here. Lovely. I'm going to sprinkle a little extra herbage that I have here. My herby scrambled egg. So there you have it, my almond breeze apple pancakes, some gorgeous herby scrambled eggs, two brilliant dishes for the whole family, nutritious, delicious and really easy to make.